Okay, my name is Ron Thompson. I'm from Lorraine, Ohio. I have a 1974 G10 Chevy van. I uh, purchased it uh, about a year ago at uh, Nightmare. Uh, I used to have a band called Flame. This is the one that took me a little over three years to find another black shorty that I wanted to do. And we've been working on this one off and on. We really enjoyed it. We put about 10,000 miles on it in the last year. I redid the motor on it, um, put a 700 R tranny in it and stuff like that. And there's been a lot of cleaning, then replaced the one rear door, repainted those. Other than that, I just cleaned it up. And we did a little work on the interior. We did put a uh, uh, power sofa bed in it and then put a uh, shag carpet. Everybody wanted to call it a shag and wagon. So I figured I'd just call it, put some shag carpet in it. A friend of mine just happened to give it to me. So we stuck that in last week. And I hope I'm going to get some chrome bumpers or get these re-chromed here pretty soon. But the van's going to be called uh, Move Van On. Uh, most people that know me know that's from, you know, the van, uh, flame unfortunately got destroyed. So I'm going to redo this one up. Not like flame, but it's going to have its own personality. And we're hopefully do a lot of traveling in it. We really got a good start for the, the bed and the carpeting, man. Yeah. And I got a little hot rod too, so I like to say I got bigger heads and all that stuff on the motor. Mm -hmm. 700 hours built, 411 at the rear end in it. And, and the wood on the floor is actually carpeting. Oh, really? Yeah, you have to almost touch it to even yeah. tell the difference. Yeah. Huh. I bought off a friend of mine in Pennsylvania named David. Unfortunately, I probably should tell you anyway. This used to be called the Pittsburgh Steeler van, oh. which it will never ever be called that again. <laughs> so. Is this the one that had the Steeler thing on the back? Yes, yes. No yeah. Oh, okay. But that, all the Pittsburgh Steeler stuff sort of fell off of it real quick. Yeah. <laughs> and I will give David his dash back. I won't plan on putting air conditioning on it, so I'll give him all of his dash plaques mm -hmm. and stuff back to him. Yeah. And as you've noticed, the thing has no windows at all. It's a little shorty. And that's what I was, didn't think I'd ever be able to find one that's not perfect, but we're working on it. And hopefully it'll be a very, very nice fan here real soon. All right, so we're going to do an update on this here. When? Probably next year? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah. Hopefully it'll have the bat, bat suspension and the wheels and tires and yeah. all that stuff on it by then. Hopefully to have the felt I or uh, suede. I got all the, it's going to be originally, the next step's going to be all suede interior for it. Oh, you're going to take the carpet out? Yeah. Oh. We just put that in there, you know, because everybody's calling it a shagging wagon. So. Oh, that's easy to say that. Yeah. yeah. Actually, I, I got the carpeting to make strips so I could lay on it and work on other vehicles. And I got to measure how much I had. And we said, well, I think we got enough to do the van. So we just yeah. got in there and did it. Yeah. 